Today, I'm going to be trying to make a simple guitar drill beat, most likely with simple guitar melodies, and maybe a flute and a bass line, and that's it. Just want to see if I can make some different subgenres of drill that aren't necessarily just dark pianos and spooky vocals, you know? After doing that for like 20 times in a row, it gets old, so I'm trying to mix it up a little bit. Most likely just going to use some contact banks and, I don't know, like a flute from Mellotron 5 and see where it goes, so let's just make a start. Obviously, if we're making guitar drill type beats, we're going to needed a guitar sound so let's just open one in contact i'm probably going to use nylon strings by Ilya fmo because it doesn't necessarily sound realistic but i just like the way it sounds basically it's also got a guitar and a keyboard mode you can make it sound realistic like a guitar or you can make it play almost like a piano like an actual vst there's a lot of different options you can mess around with here to make it sound the way you want it and i think for the melody i'm just going to use like two chords i'm going to keep it really simple so minor harmonic chords um so i can build a top line melody we're gonna keep the bpm around 140 142 for this one i think I'm going to increase it by one semitone, I think. Not a bad start. As you can see, it's on guitar mode, so it's playing a bit more realistic. I'm just going to alter some of the notes and change the velocity to make it sound a bit more realistic, because I'm not really a fan of how the velocity sound about right now. Okay, that sounds good to me. I'm gonna clone this plugin and try and make a top line melody, I think. All right, this might sound a bit stupid, but I'm actually going to go into uh, one third step, so just triplet. And it's going to sound slightly off time to the original chords, but hopefully it works well. Okay, it doesn't sound too bad. I think it's missing a couple of grace notes and stuff like that. And I need to change the velocities around because right now it sounds way too robotic. Okay, wait. Very nice. Okay, I like it. I like it. I might just go really stereotypical and really like just, you know, exactly what kind of beat I'm talking about. I'm like thinking like 2017 YouTube Quavo type beat, Sesh Nolan type beat. I don't know, like Latin guitar samples with flutes, but instead of trap, it's going to be drill. When everyone started using this flute, I really was not a fan. But now that I actually have the plugin, it's like I'm, I'm using it in most of my loops now, which I'm not happy to admit. But if it sounds good, it sounds good. So... Not too bad. Okay, hold on. Um, once again, I'm just gonna change the velocities around and stuff and maybe move a couple of notes and we'll see what comes out. Now, what do we use for the bass? Mm. I'm gonna open Trillion. We'll see what we can find. I'm gonna add some guitar slides as well.
All right, I like that. What we're going to do is we're going to clone this again and then add a slide down preset. And we're going to add this one to the baseline so that there's just a bit of variation and it's not just repeating. I'm going to mix the melody first and then add the drums. I think that's the smartest thing to do. Okay. All right, let's add some thermal and hope that it doesn't crash like the last video. <laughs> What I love about this combination is you could probably make like 10 of these loops a day and not get bored. You would probably get bored. Or you could just turn it into a beat really easily by just laying down a simple drum pattern, which is probably what I'm about to do right now. Let's listen to the whole thing completed. I'm gonna need like a like a bongo or something. There we go.
Hold up, I need to rename this clap. Music producers have no need for this. Much better. All right, yeah, I think it needs an 808, so we're going to add one. It means I'm gonna mute the bass and then come up with a 808 bass line. Drums are basically done, so I'm just going to mix them. Perfect, all right, we're going to arrange the beat. That's good. That is good. I like that. I like that. Overall, pretty simple beat to make. Just like two chord guitar progression, top line melody, flute, bass line. That's it. It's all you need. It took like what? 30 minutes to make overall. So really not that bad. I don't know what kind of artist would go over this. Maybe let me know in the comments. Let's just listen to the beat and then see what I could have done better for next time, I think. <laughs> 